Yor! <laughs> anyway, just making sure. You know, it has begun. <laughs> Wait till y'all get nice and tucked in. All right, everybody. Looks like the you know, the chat is moving pretty nicely. So, all right. Anyway, how do I explain this? Okay, I'm gonna be like I I was gonna make a like a real video out of this, like a real um um uh dramatic reading, like I did with the Zootopia comics, but. I gotta get the unicorn store video finished. Like, you know, this is just, this would just get in the way. So I was just like, fuck it. I'm gonna live stream it. I'm gonna try to make this as coherent as possible. Like, I might laugh my ass off during, <laughs> during this whole thing because he's got some spelling. He's got, uh, like, he's got misspellings throughout the whole fucking thing. Ugh, I don't understand. Like, there's so many misspellings on on his end of the conversation, and I'm gonna be like, I'm I'm not gonna correct it. I'm just gonna say it to add to his uh his depressive hillbilly you know aura. Um, yeah, but like, yeah. So basically, on Twitter, he sent some DMs to this YouTuber, not YouTuber, ah, to this person on Twitter named I of Saul. Sent her some DMs being hella manipulative and you know, threatening threatening to fucking kill himself and just, just acting like a dick. And I thought it was kind of... And it's, it, it's just... It's really bad. And I thought it was kind of fun. Like, the more I, 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 the more I read through it, the funnier it got, at least for me, because I have a sick personality. Oh, Wiz Division Productions, $2 Super Chat. Thank you. Uh, Obi Wan, um, Obi Wan voice. Hello there. <laughs> uh, J Day one two three four five six seven eight nine ten five dollars super chat. Uh, change your name to uh, J Brab Brab Bone. I have no idea how. I I don't know. <laughs> but anyway. Uh yeah like. Basically, yeah, he sent some DMs, some really damning DMs, and we're gonna read through them. Like I said, who knows? I might, uh, I might, uh, I don't know, like download this, uh, my, this stream, and then take the file, and then make a little edit out of it, you know, to shorten it in case people don't want to sit through a fucking two, three hour stream. I might do that after I'm done with my unicorn store review. But like I said, I wanted to do it this way because it's just going to get in the way of other shit I have to do. So I think it'd be better. All right, let's get started. Like I said, bear with me because <laughs> y'all know how my voice acting is. It keeps changing. So just like bear with me. I can't. It's not going to be um, refined by editing. So <laughs> all right, let's do it. Hey, man, you said to DM you if I needed to talk. So I am. I know you po <laughs> I know you post about me already, but I wanted to trust <laughs> but I wanted to trust you, so I hope you won't share what I'm gonna say. Can I trust you? Of course you can trust me. Honesty without compromise. That's my mantra. Oh no. After seeing your Twitter feed, oh I guess you would just call it my nipple anyways. <laughs> Oh, shit. Uh, what? <laughs> you seem to think really low of me. Sorry I messaged you. Have a good night. Manipulation asterisk. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Listen, if you genuinely care about opening a dialogue, you'll hear what I have to say. I don't. Sorry. Nothing I can do. Nothing I could do would convince you. <laughs> oh shit! Nothing I could do would act for to convince you. I fear. Sounds like he 
<laughs> right there, it sounded like he was a cat spitting up a fucking furball. Oh, God. You don't need to convince me of anything. That's not your job. So it doesn't matter. You think that stuff about me is true, so I would never change your memory. It's not for the record. Sorry, you think it is. Uh, I think this... <laughs> I think the stuff about you is true because I have seen it firsthand. Of course, I'm not referring to any of your past actions. If I was that person, I would want me dead too. I don't blame you for feeling that way. <laughs> really, motherfucker? Like, who mentioned even hatred? Like, she, she hasn't expressed any animosity towards him in this entire conversation so far. And he's like, I'd want me dead too. <laughs> fucking ukulele not ukulele um oh my god what's that fucking thing the banjo banjo sad banjo strum <laughs> oh my god i want me dead too Bang. <laughs> uh, i don't want you dead can't you see what you're doing you don't know me. How do you see it firsthand? Are we friends in real life? You interpret any and all criticism as a threat against yourself. However, my focus is on you, not because you are Boogie Two Nine Eight Eight. My focus is on because my focus is on because my focus falls on anyone who is a chronic manipulator. Ting. Um. It is a threat, though. It impacts my life. It damages my business and lickety shickety hood. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I'm really easy to make laugh. Oh, Mr. N, $5 super chat, banjo, kapui. <laughs> oh, God. Um. Shit. All right, let me read that again. Ugh. It is a threat, though. It impacts my life. It damages my business and look at the diggity hood and my mental health. I understand your concern. I am not a chronic manipulator, though. But if you believe what Reddit says about me, I guess you will believe that. I guess you think I am impulsive in <laughs> you now. However, do, however, do you think it's healthy to surround yourself with a cocoon of endless reassurance? A hive mind of yes men who cannot criticize... Bleh. Oh my god, I didn't read that as a question. A hive mind of yes men who cannot criticize you? Do you really think that is the what, what's, what's best for you? I just saw your tweet needed to talk. No manipulation intended. Sorry. Of course I appreciate you reaching out to me. I have zero. I have zero reassurance. I have zero reassurance. What the blow are you talking about? The internet hates me. Check Reddit. I do check Reddit. You know that I do. I have no family or friends, and more people on my online hate me than I can. Oh God, I I can barely fucking read this because it's just so pity. Just a bunch of pity me bullshit. I have no family or friends and more people online hate me than, than care about me. <clears throat> That's why I say about that. <laughs> However, like I said, I'm not concerned with what you, what you done in the past. Oh shit. What I'm concerned with is how you treat the people who admire you. Oh yeah. And uh, at least one message is missing here. What does it say? Just thought I should note that whatever's at the top uh, edge of the next message didn't make it. You can kind of see some of the letters. Oh, shit. Uh, Foo Fox, one, $5 super chat. Oh, my God. Got no glasses. I'm just learning about this. But on a scale of 1 to 10, how bad is it? I mean, it's pretty bad. You're threatening to kill yourself. And you're like, basically, uh, uh, suicide baiting is pretty fucking bad. A Wiz Division production says when you need online assure, uh, that validation to get through the day, you truly have reached a new low. Yeah. 
this is sad. <laughs> yeah, basically this message says like there's a piece of the uh, there's a there's like a, uh, there's a DM missing, like there's a, a piece of the uh, conversation missing. So <laughs> yes, they do, and they listen to you. Please don't share this on Reddit. You promised, okay? <laughs> they respect you and what you say. You can influence them either negatively or positively. Sorry I bothered you. I hope you <laughs> Sorry I bothered you. I hope your promise means something. Good night. You have a lot of you have a lot more sway in people's lives than you think. Aww. Uh, you have a lot more, oh, shit, I'm just reading the same shit over again. And I know you know this. Not anymore. Red did took that away. My career is over. <laughs> From what I've seen, like, yeah, there are people who talk shit about him. But I've never seen, like, I, I don't see, like, droves of people fucking hating him. I mean, I don't follow him that closely. I'm not gonna lie. I don't follow, follow him on, uh, Twitter and I'm not subscribed to him on YouTube. So who knows? Everyone could fucking hate him. I don't know. But everything, um, but, uh, I've seen nothing but, like, support for him in recent years and all that shit. Even I've uh, taken a form. I think when, um, when No Bullshit made a video on him, uh, I was like, okay, like, alright, really? Like, the motherfucker, like, you're complaining about the guy documenting his weight loss on his YouTube channel. Like, come on, like, grow up. But that was back before he started to, like, really show some fucked up traits. Like, really, really. Before it was just, like, whispers. But, yeah. You know, but, yeah, now I feel like a fucking jackass because now he's fucking, like, suicide baiting and shit and doing all this this nonsense. Oh, massive legend. His spelling is terrible because the stroke finally caught up to him. <laughs> Okay. Uh oh, you're not stupid. All I wanted all I wanted to say was this. Pay clo close attention next for my birthday in July. You will be really happy, I promise. You could do so much more for the people who still hang on to your content. The ones who still smile at your bleh, smile at you and treat you, treat what you say with respect and admiration. They will be happy then too. Promise. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, all you do is take from them. All you ever do is take from them and give them nothing of substance in return. Now, nah, I'm giving it all back in July. Watch. You will be really happy. Promise. He sounds like a fucking child. Oh, yeah, and there's a hundred, a hundred and five more fucking messages. But like, like I said, he sounds like a fucking kid. You'll be happy, I promise. Don't be mad at me, please. I gotta fucking lean back. Okay, there we go. Uh, video content is much more ubiquitous. <laughs> video content is much more ubiquitous than it used to be. They can get what you offer in a thousand different places. Good night, my friend. <laughs> you can claim to be a positive influence on them, yet you never do anything for them. I don't think you're, I don't think you're reading what I'm saying, are you? Because I can tell you're afraid of your fans. You can tell what? You're afraid of the power they have over you. Oh shit! Uh, Autism cat, two dollars super chat, boogie two nine eight eight, professional victim extraordinaire. Yeah, I mean he's just he's just acting like a little boy right now in, in these fucking DMs. Shit. You got new teeth, man. I thought you was good. <laughs> you got new chompers. You were supposed to be a thug. <laughs> anyway. No, I love my fans. I am afraid of Kiwi Farms. I said in all, in, with no, with with no, oh God. Uh, $2 super chat. Uh, Taylor uh, Ramirez. Uh, who is he even talking to? I don't know. It's this person on Twitter named Eye of Saul. I don't know who that is, but like, you know, when, all I know is that th this exchange is pretty funny. <coughs> like, he said this with no, um, oh God. He said this in all sincerity. 
absolutely no, unironically, just <laughs> all seriousness. I'm afraid of Kiwi Farms. <laughs> Old man Kiwi had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on this farm, he had some dirt, E-I-E-I-O. With a manipulate here and a manipulate there. Here a nip, there a nip, everywhere a nip, nip, old man. <laughs> All right, what the fuck? Okay, let me stop. And so you keep them at arm's length. You're so terrified of people turning against you that you have to apologize 20 times for something that shouldn't e shouldn't have even involved you in the first place. Nah, I love my fans. No, no, nah, I love man fans. Spent last weekend hugging over 500 of them and thanking them for personally, uh, thanking them them personally for their help. Hugging a fan doesn't mean you love them. Yeah, I make mistakes. Do you ever just talk to your fans? Never said, never said it did. Oh God, I can't stand it when like, there are they're on the last question that was asked while the other person is like far <laughs> far away in the conversation <clears throat> this uh yeah boogie 2988 his bullshit's making me gassy mm. you well you know get in a private chat and listen to what they have to say yeah all the time i thought you were a fan it's Adder why I'm talking to you. I have talked to three people, three other people tonight, just like this. I do it every day. Do you ever just talk to them when the subject isn't yourself or related to yourself? Because I've yet to see any evidence of that. <laughs> she's fucking, she's fucking roasting them. She's like, she's killing them. It's always about them. I ask, I ask her not to, <laughs> not their life. And talk talk about their problems. Then why do you tell suicidal young people that life is meaningless? Uh oh. Oh god. Uh, say just listen real quick. If you didn't mind, okay. <laughs> say just listen real quick. If you didn't mind, okay, because this is all moot anyways. Can you listen for a minute, like motherfucker? You act like you're in the in the same room with her. Like it's not like she's shouting over you. It's messages. It's messaging. There's no, like, you don't have to, like, make someone quiet. Like, oh, God, what a puss. Ugh. Why do you have them, have them spend their money on you when they could be using it on themselves? Yes, of course. Uh, I guess she's, a she's answering, uh, can you listen for a minute? Uh. I would have said, like, look, nigga, like, I'm not in the same room with you. I'm not yelling at you. There is no wait a minute. Like, you message, I read the shits, respond to it, whatever. Uh, this is all moot anyways. I didn't trust, I didn't, I didn't trust you enough to go into details. But remember, you promised not to share this, Okay. Just because I'm not on your side doesn't mean you can't trust me. And I will rule you. <coughs> and I will rule you if you promise again. I am critical of your actions, but I am not your enemy. Just promise, please. I really want to tell you. This is none of Reddit's business. This is between you and me. Okay, good. Oh, shit. Yeah, whatever. Okay, good. On my birthday, I'm doing something really big. It are gonna be... It's, it are gonna make everyone real happy. My f oh, my God. He's just starting to sound like Simple Jack. Oh, my God. <laughs> it are gonna... It gonna... It are, it are gonna make everyone really happy. My fans and my haters, too. You are gonna love it, especially Reddit. On my birthday, I'm... <laughs> Uh, okay, God damn it, I can't stand that. Oh, you gotta make these. You gotta make these clean. I get confused easy. I'm old. <clears throat> you are gonna love it, especially Reddit. I just want to. I just want to got to. I just want to got to one. one I just got to one last VidCon and say goodbye to everyone and see my fans one last time. I see. 
So you're shutting your channel down then. But it's what everyone wants from me, and it's really going to help a lot of people. <clears throat> Are you sure about that? Nah, is that what you want me? Is that what you want me to do? Despite what you say, there are people who still who will still. Ah, where the fuck did I get still from? Oh my god! Oh my god! Despite what you say, there are people who will miss you. Yeah, after this Etika situation, it's <clears throat> after this Etika situation, it's really obvious what I got to do, and I was already planning. Oh God, Jesus Christ! And you had why the fuck would you mention Etika? What's the point of that? I, honestly, what is the fucking point of mentioning Etika at a time like this? This is supposed to be like a small, intimate uh, interaction between two people. After the Etika thing, you, you know, just shut the fuck up. It's fucking file your teeth down to four inches, goddammit. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that, that, if you wanted an explanation about my thumbnail, I said on Twitter before that he looked like, he got these new teeth. He got his teeth fixed, and um, they're nice, but I think they don't fit his face because he he looks like evil Inspector Gadget from that Matthew Broderick Inspector Gadget movie <laughs> with the big ass chompers and shit. It does, yeah, it just doesn't look right on him. I think he should get him filed down a little bit because looks like he's got a fucking priest a priest collar in his mouth. <laughs> anyway, oh, I get it. So you're planning to follow the same route then, or are you just trying to get me to back off by hinting at a suicide attempt? Ding, ding, ding. Well, like Reddit says, those guys will want me around once Reddit convinces me I am a monster. No, feel free to go as hard as you want, dude. It's a moot point. Ugh. Excuse me. <laughs> Do you see the problem here? The solution is literally right in front of you. They say... Oh, yeah, she misspelled your... Uh, they say you're a monster. I know it is, and I'm gonna do... And I'm gonna do it. It's gonna be awesome. All you have to do is be better than what they say you are. Like, yeah, I, <laughs> exactly. I am, but they don't care. Believe me, so it doesn't matter. Wah, wah. <laughs> this, he sounds like such a child. Stop. I mean, I've, I've, se and I actually, I've actually seen children less whiny than him. If you become better than what they say you are, then their criticism cannot hurt you. No, Boogie, you aren't. Right now, you're not. You're exactly the monster they say you are. But in my birthday, they will have no choice and they will see. They will... S I'll show them! <laughs> I'll throw away all, all my money that I... Uh, uh, he's totally fucking bullshitting. I'm sure he'll just promise the shit and not... Oh, yeah, because this, yeah, this was a long time ago. Uh, about a month ago, so. Yeah, it turns out he didn't fucking do it. <laughs> uh, but you have every every opportunity to not be the monster they think you are. I wish this, f I wish this, this f were true, because if I was that monster, I would al already have killed myself. I never wanted to have sex with kids. Where are we going with this? I never wanted to have sex with kids. I never abused my wife. None of it is true. <laughs> I didn't say that. That's not what we're talking about. Reddit did. I know they did. Yes, it is. The mega Read the mega thread. However, we're not talking about Reddit. You and I, right now, are talking about your current behavior. I'm talking about Reddit, though. Oh, my God. Would you get the fuck off Reddit? <laughs> Why do you care so much about what they think of you? Listen, I'm not going to tell you. Listen, I'm, <laughs> Listen, I'm just going to tell you so you know. Oh, well, let me answer that first. Oh, God. I understand that being intensely scrutinized can be very mentally and emotionally taxing. 
My dad molested me. Oh, here we go. <laughs> my dad molested me, so so did my sister. It ruined my life. I hate pedophiles with a passion, so them calling me one really fucks with me bad. I would kill a, a pedophile. <laughs> I would kill a pedophile. I would never harm a child. So listen. I would never harm a child. So listen. Oh Christ. I am listening. I mean, right. Because fucking DMs, idiot. Wait, I'm going to read some of these comments right quick. A video game uh oh seven the video game oh seven said that's not relevant to the to what we're ready to say it Clive Mercer says Wings of Redemption vibes with that voice. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what I was going like I wanted something whiny and redneckish, so Uh, oh my god. Theater Troid, manipulation and melodrama aside, Boogie's a very sick man from what I've seen. Yeah, I feel sorry for him. It's But like, when you start threatening suicide and shit, and start like manipulating people, like, come on. Come on! Come on! And you know people don't like you. Like, you said it. You know people don't like you for your actions, yet you don't try to like, at least pull yourself back and like, take a minute to think or get off the internet for a while. Like, come on! Let's get it together. Okay. On my birthday, I'm <laughs> on my birthday, I'm dedicating my fortune to several charities. What's left of it anyways. I'm going to do it like a fortune. Does he really, he really have a fortune? Has he, has he really got that much money? I'm, I'm not hating. I'm just saying. Uh, I'm going to do a huge charity event and, my, and, match, <laughs> and match it dollar for dollar till I am broke. Good, that sounds like a good idea. But don't commit suicide after you do that. <laughs> just do just do the first part. Then when I am broke, I'm gonna <laughs> Then when I am broke, I'm gonna wait a couple years so everyone forgets about me, then you know. <laughs> I can't do it when it will still hurt my fans. Jesus Christ. That's why I'm still here. But once Reddit has fully convinced everyone I want to hurt kids or whatever, they can, then I can go. How about you just do the first part without any caveats? <laughs> do it because you want to help people. Because once I am broke, I will be able to support myself. Not because you want to fade into obscurity uh, so you can kill yourself. Look, man, you're Boogie. You know, Boogie. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, that part kind of made me laugh. She's been mostly like, uh, she's been like rational and like, basically like, just like, just an average person so far, but that kind of made me laugh. Look, man, you're Boogie. You know, Boogie? <laughs> I don't know, made me laugh. Mm, I was him. Now I am just, now I am just, what? What? Reddit makes me have to be. The worm to the the worm to bids I want I want the worm to bids I want to fuck kids Didi I'm so done <laughs> oh boy if you can if you can be just a little bit better than what people say you are then you will never be broke then just come out and say it if Reddit scares you so much. You need to t uh, to make an ultim oh, blah. You need to make an ultimatum. Not on Twitter. Not on Twitch. Yes, I will because I'm giving it all away. I don't deserve it. Saint Jude does. There, <clears throat> there isn't much left after the divorce. I'm sorry, after the divorce. <laughs> but maybe if I help the kids, Saint Jude, Saint Judges, my <laughs> Saint Judges, maybe the world won't think I wanted to fuck kids. <laughs> Um, I don't think that's how it works. Um, you know, Michael Jackson, he gave way to a lot of charities too. Held little like kitty parties at his house and shit. And people still thought he was a pedophile. Actually, people might be more suspicious that you're a pedophile because you're, you're giving all your money away to kids. It just seems a little bit weird.
If I give kids money, they won't think I want to fuck kids. <laughs> on YouTube, on YouTube in plain view. No, they already won. Let them have it. You won't even, so you won't even try? They haven't won. Like you mel fucking melodramatic garden on the fearful. God, God damn it. Uh, no Alton Stisms. <laughs> no Alton Stiums. No Alton Stiums. Just let them have their victory. They deserve it. They worked really hard. This is no win or lose situation unless you let it be. I am just one man and there are thousands of people. If they win, if they win, then it'd be the greater good. I can suffer. I can suffer. Do they can be happy? <laughs> They're not happy. Don't you get it? Basically, everyone in that sub was once a fan of yours. They will be once they have destroyed me, though. So let them have it. They're not. They're there not not because they hate you for no reason. They hate you because you let them down. And instead of feeling bad for yourself, you should feel bad for them. They were your responsibility and you let them down. <clears throat> well, they won't be let down once I am done and they win and they can be happy, right? Because whether you like it or not, your fans are your responsibility. I hear you. Will you fix it in less than 30 days? Stay tuned. <laughs> oh, so we'll, we'll fix it in less than 30 days. Stay tuned. Oh, he's still going back to this shit. Not to support you, but to make sure they're supporting you for the right reasons. Nobody on that sub wants you dead, okay? Not a single one. <laughs> Love you, man. Thanks for the chat. Feel better. And it's good to know I, I am on the right track. They all do. I read it daily. They may not be willing to forgive you, but nobody wants you dead. They do. Trust mister. <laughs> it's like, like, he tries, like, he, <laughs> he starts to end the fucking conversation and walk away. But he comes right back because that's exactly what he wants. He wants someone to say, no, come back. It's, it's not the way, Boogie. It's not the way. That's the kind of reaction he's looking for. He starts to pull away a bit, like, it's almost like he wants you to think that he's about to off himself. Like, oh, if I let him go now, he's gonna do it, he's gonna do it, so then you have no choice but to, like, call him back. It's so fucking pathetic. Ugh. Uh, and if they aren't willing to forgive you, then you don't need their attention. They don't. No, they don't. Shit. Um... Not once have, have I seen a post on there saying, Die Boogie, or something of the like. I see it daily. I get dozens of death threats. Every post I've seen there is just ones of disappointment. They tell me daily to kill myself. Can you show me one? Some proof? Emails and tweets and, emails and, tweets and YouTube comments. Can you please show me? Uh, let's we'll see where it, we'll see where this goes. Keeping in mind that death threats in YouTube comments are pretty common, I get death I get death threats too. Hell, I've been doxxed for banning someone from my Discord server. Um. Uh, okay, I will force I will force you to <laughs> I will force you to watch me fuck your disgusting pig wife with a twelve inch metal rod. Then I will take my meat cleaver and hack her to death in front of your own just diabetic eyes. Before she is dead, I will curb stomp her, and finally I will take my forty five, shove it down your throat, and breaking your diabetic teeth, and then squeeze the trigger, watching your brain splatter everywhere. I will take great joy in this and will masturbate over your dead wife's body. <laughs> Proof. I deleted most of it, though. Why won't you delete the whole fucking thing? <laughs> I only deleted most of it. Like, the, the whole paragraph, I may have deleted, like, I don't know, the part where he said he wanted to gouge out my eyes and, uh, fuck my face. Um, and, uh, you know, put an atom bomb in my taint. Like, that shit I got rid of. <laughs> that shit I got I, that shit I got rid of, but I kept everything else. I'm sure he, he's probably talking about like um separate emails, but like 
like just judging from this, like in the context, it sounds like he's saying he deleted most of the message. <laughs> um. Oh, when did you get this? Just Google my name on Twitter. Dunno. So in your mind, is this person worth listening to? Before I got divorced, it's one of the few I didn't re- delete because I had to keep it keep it for the cops. Is someone who says they want you physically hurt? Well, I have. Is someone who says they want to physically hurt you someone you need to pay in mo- pay any mind? Do you equate general criticism on the same level as literal death threats? Not him, no. <laughs> oh God, that was that was I I fucked up my own fucking voice right there. Hang on. Not him, no. But the tens of thousands of people who agree with him, yes. Tens of thousands of people. Tens of thousands of people do not fucking th- send you death threats. It's such a lion ass. Uh, I am just one person, and it, and if my death will bring joy to so many people, I am selfish not to do it. Oh God, God! At this point, like when someone says some shit like that, that's so melodramatic. I just like it made me sound insensitive. But I just can't believe they're really gonna fucking kill themselves. Because it's just so, it sounds so fake. Ugh. It sounds like it sounds so insincere and phony, I, and I can't take it seriously for the life of me. Uh, I just, I just, ha- I just have to wait till my fans move on. <laughs> One email doesn't e- equal ten thousand people, exactly. Not all criticism is fine. It's why I haven't muted you. <laughs> That's FCC thinking right there. No, Dodd. <laughs> No, Dad. <laughs> no, Dad. Lol. I have t- seen tens of thousands of people say it. If criticism is fine, then why have you, then why have you deflected all of my criticism with talk about suicide, mental illness, and lack of money? Oh shit. Uh, real character. Five dollar super chat. Fans of your vids. Uh, thank you for your sacrifices for my amusement. Here's five bucks. Thank you. That's much appreciated. <laughs> Mm. Why have you not acknowledged a single thing I've said to you? Do you see what I'm saying when I... Do you see what I'm saying when I say you are a manipulator? Because these are things I am most... (laughs) These are things I am most worried about. Your issues are no longer relevant. I can't take your average... It's too late. (laughs) Is it really? Y'all, check Reddit. Too many people are convinced I am a child raper. Uh, tell them you're not then. I can't ever change their minds. I gotta go. (laughs) Don't use alts. Make a post. I have. They don't listen or care. Don't use alts. I don't use alts, lol. That's another lie of theirs. Hmm. Tell them that you're hurt by what they've said and that they have no proof. Only Reddit all and only Reddit alt I only Reddit all I is my porn one. The fuck? <laughs> I see. The issue is you keep uh, the issue is you keep them at arm's length because you're so afraid you're so afraid of the power they have over you. But haven't. But haven't you heard that? But haven't you ever heard the best way to defeat your enemy is to make them your friend? Meet them halfway. Your your problem is you never try to meet anyone halfway. I have done exactly that. Address those claims in your YouTube in your YouTube video last week as a last ditch attempt, but it didn't stop them. Help me, Open One Kenobi, your my only hope. <laughs> Because nothing is ever your fault. It's all my fault, dude. I take full blame. Then why don't you reflect that attitude in your public posts? Sure, you can say that to me here, in this private place. I have. They ignore them, though, in in favor of the narrative. But I've yet to see any evidence that you are capable of accepting guilt and blame upon yourself. No, I'm sorry, but you... No, I'm sorry, but you haven't. I literally said all of this on my YouTube channel last week and on on Twitter daily. They don't care. They will never stop. 
Did you watch that video? Uh, which one? Oh, shit. Taylor Ramirez, $5 super chat. I believe this more if it wasn't to a random person over Twitter DMs. Yeah, it's just... It just seems really... Oh, Mr. N, $2 super chat. Uh, this sounds similar to that one uh, hick with the animals. <laughs> okay, that's so vague. I can't... I, I have no idea who you're talking about. But a lot of hicks sound like that, so... It'll probably come to me eventually. I literally... Oh, I literally said I wasn't a pedophile over and over. They still claim it, though. <laughs> right, because there's no proof to counteract that statement. This one... Oh, how this trip saved me. Nah. Things you said uh, contradict that notion. I'm not saying I agree with that. That I'm not saying I agree with that. That is merely the sentiment. How do you prove you don't want to fuck kids? I don't, but I still can't prove that. I'm not sure how you'd prove it physically other than just don't fuck kids. <laughs> but you can prove it verbally. There is no proof. There is one statement taken out of context where I'll say I didn't, I didn't S and kids because I, I, cause got, I got molested. By not saying things like I can't, I can't, bleh. by not saying things like I can't have kids because I'm, af I, I'm afraid I'd molest them. I got, did he really say that shit? Oh Lord. Jesus, Jesus, Lord. Oh, damn it. By not saying things like I can't have kids because I'm afraid I'll molest them. Oh, boogie. You idiot. <laughs> I've already tried to prove it verbally. I didn't say that. Rawful. <laughs> okay. I don't know all the context, context of that. So I'll give you that one. Uh. Excuse me. Go back and look. <laughs> go back and look at, at St. Cliff. <laughs> go back. Oh my god. A Wisdom Vision $5 super chat. Your friends and especially strangers are not your unpaid personal therapist to dump your baggage onto. Just saying. 100%. Preach. I mean, just... Ugh. That's what. That's kind of like a problem with YouTube. There's no vetting process for, <laughs> for people who get famous on here. And it's like, it's not like Hollywood where people can, when, as soon as they get some clout, they can hide all their demons and shit. Like, when you get on YouTube, there's no hiding it. Like, people, like, there's there's so much access to public, to uh, to make to make your demons public. Oh, shit. Uh, Rachel Duncan, $2 Super Chat Boogie, constantly digs himself into deeper holes. Yeah. Like, just get off the internet for a while. Just, just. Just fuck off for a while. That's all you gotta do. Go back and look at Saint that clip. That was clearly not what I said. Again, my issue is with your current behavior, not your past behavior. That whole list is like that. This Lucy Fox shit, for example. So nothing that mega threat. So nothing about that mega threat is accurate, you're saying. That woman tried to blackmail me, and when I wouldn't give her the time, give it, ah, and when I wouldn't give her the money, she, ah, and when I wouldn't give her the money, she made, and when I wouldn't give her the money, she made that hit piece video on me. Okay, okay, but again, I'm talking to you about your current behavior, not your past behavior. There are a few accurate things: the Holocaust thing I said, the LGBTQ thing I said. God, I want to know what the fuck he said <laughs> regarding the Holocaust. Um, to be honest, I don't really give a toss about what you've done in the past. Those are true, and I deeply regret them. I believe that. I'm glad you don't bit. I am glad you don't bit. Mo <laughs> I am glad you don't bit. Most people do. <laughs> because your actions reflected that. And even if I could appease you, I can't appease them, so appeasing you is a moose. He said appease way too many times. Uh, Taylor Ramirez, $2 Super Chat, does he not have autocorrect on? Um, I think he, like... I think his fingers are so fucking big. 
We're probably so fat, he keeps accidentally turning it off. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck. Like, or maybe, like, the circuits of the phone are just fizzled out because every time he puts it in his pocket, it gets so fucking hot. And it's <laughs> just... It gets so fucking hot that it gets confused on its own. Snicker dudes, four ninety nine super chat. What, what fresh hell have I just clicked on? You deserve money for the suffering to this garbage. Thank you, Snicker dudes. It is pretty bad. Um. Yeah, like I said, his phone. Like I said, the heat from his fucking thigh when he keeps his phone in his pocket probably shorted out the circuits, and now the autocorrect doesn't work. Because that's the only exp explanation for this shit. For the most part, at least, uh, you don't need to appease me. I'm not some god of judgment here. Doesn't matter what you are. I <clears throat> Doesn't matter what you are. I am just explaining to you that as long as Kiwi Farms is doing this, there is only one way out. Ask Chloe. Don't know who the fuck that is. My issue with you is is that <laughs> my issue issue is ugh, the fuck. My issue with you is that I resent how you manipulate the goodwill of your audience and are unable to take personal responsibility for your actions, as well as your habit of injecting yourself into every single situation. I don't care what you've done in the past. I'm not a judge, jury, or execu executioner. <laughs> My issue with you is that I resent how you manipulate the goodwill of your audience and are unable to take... Pro oh, I already fucking read this. Oh, you idiot. Uh, however, this is not the first time my eyes have been set on situations like this. Well, I get that. Well, I get that. I get that. I get that as your... Prof <laughs> well, I get that as your... Prof oh, my God. Well, I get that as your perception of me and... Were that the truth, I would try to fix it. But even if I was, and I did, it's a moot point, <laughs> Bo, anyway. It's it's a moot point, Bo, anyway. Yeah, the bad spelling fucks me up. Like, if I read something wrong, it'll fuck up the entire fucking sentence. So you only wanted to talk to me to change my mind. No. What makes you think my mind can't be changed? Changing your mind is moot. He keeps saying fucking moot. So I'm saying, is that the only word in your vocabulary? I'm sorry. I'm going to kill myself. July. <laughs> uh, July. What was the other word he kept saying? Oh, my God. Uh, let me go back. Let me go back. Let me go back. What was it? What was it? What was it? What was it? Oh, appease. That's what it was. Yeah, appease July. Appease July money. I don't fuck kids. This is the only fucking thing he's been saying throughout this whole fucking thing. Um, um Changing your mind is moot. Who's to say it is? What if you got a what if you got a supporter in me? It does, it does not matter if you can or can't support... Oh, I accidentally said that correctly. Uh, it does not matter if you can or can't support your your mind. Wait. It does not matter if you can or can't uh, change your mind. It's already over. Then you can't possibly convince them to stop, and neither can I. It's already over. In the end, it doesn't even matter. I had to put it all. In the end, it doesn't even matter. Um, uh, Wisdom Vision two dollars super chat is moot the boogie version of a boot. Hmm. I mean, like he just keeps keep fucking repeat. He keeps fucking repeating. There's a certain words he's repeating over and over again. I don't know if that's a part of his manipulation tactic or what, but it's like, dude, like, just dictionary, dictionary. Even if it was, I orally didn't matter. Okay, just, just know it won't change anything, but I am glad to listen to you if it helps you. It doesn't help me because I don't need help. <laughs> then why bother? However, I think that, however, I think that this could perhaps give you some perspective. Oh, shit. Um... Massive le legend, two dollars super chat. Appease the moot. <laughs> Appease the moot. 
this July, appease the moot. You will be so much happier if you do. <laughs> you just keep saying the same shit. It just... Oh, it makes me laugh. Um, don't worry about it. Not to change your mind just for... Not to change your mind just for a bit of perspective. That's all. I don't need perspective. It's already over. Oh my god. It's like talking in circles. Like talking to a brick wall. Stop it. I just want to play like Linkin Park's most emo songs. Every time he speaks. <laughs> in the end, it doesn't even matter. Well, if it's already over, then what's a couple of more minutes listening to a little story? Sure, if it will help you or make you feel good, I am glad to listen, man. He is so fucking condescending. Like, I don't need help. Even though I was like basically threatening to kill myself. I don't need any help. Like, fucking nothing. Ugh. Excuse me. And now he's, like, trying to put the owner, like, put this shit off on him. Like, he's sacrificing everything just by talking. Like, he's sacrificing his time talking to her. Like, oh, I'm beyond saving. So I must save this, the unsaved. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. I am basically the angel Gabriel. Or miss. Don't mean to cisgender. Miss... <laughs> Miss Gender <laughs> Never asked your name, sorry. You can call me Saul, that's my YouTube name. Or make or make or female pronouns or do you do yo not care? Meh, not fuss with that. Okay, NP So I so I telling your story will make you feel good, please do it. Okay, look, there was a time last year when I pissed off quite a few people with a video I made. I re I recounted an experience I had with some of the people at Adult Swim that aggravated me. However, the video attracted a subset of people who really didn't take kindly to what I said. They started a big old thread on thread about me on 4chan, insulting literally every single facet of my of myself. From my appearance to my video content, it went on for a couple of days and seemed to show no signs of stopping. I even went to the thread as Anon and tried to get them to stop bagging on me, but obviously it didn't work. It just made things worse. It eventually culminated in the pitch Bible I sent to Adult Swim being broken, in broken into and having my story and art assets stolen. Oh, Taylor Ramirez, $5 Super Chat. It doesn't help me because I don't need help. Beautiful. I need to resub to Eye of Saul. <laughs> Yeah, she seems to have a good head on her, so on her shoulders. Uh, Snigger Dudes, 499 Super Chat. As someone who used, who has mental issues, illness, oh my god. Oh, my eye is watering again. I have little sympathy for people who use them to manipulate the other people around them. Yep. Amen, bro. Amen, brother. Mm. What does that which they then proceeded to make fun of mercilessly. I was seething with anger and hurt. All I could do was cry, and I felt like this was all their fault. All they were doing was trying to hurt me. Though, after the situation cooled down and the people of 4chan left me alone, I took a step back and thought about it. Whose fault was this really? Why did all their insults hurt me so much when mo Why did all their insults hurt me so much when most of them weren't even true? It's been, uh, four, it's been four years of Reddit doing this, and they will still be doing it four years after I'm gone. Our situations are different. Oh, gosh. You pity me, bitch. <laughs> Our situations are different. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're not. But you... But I had you. <laughs> but I had you, and I'm glad you found solutions for yours. I'm not saying it's the same... Ex I'm not saying it's the same situation exactly. Here... No, exactly. Actually, I never really did find a solution. Oh, well, I did. Stay tuned to see how it plays out. Chloe found it, too. Shut. Honestly, stop it. Fucking stop it. But in a way, I did find a solution because I took responsibility for the parts I could. And then he fucking links his video. Video game developer dies after setting herself on fire. Like, why are you linking that? But now he's fucking linking... Linking other people's fucking suicides to her. What a sack of crap. 
Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do like, a, can, can you, can you, uh, help me decide which suicide method to, to do? You know, because I'm just, I'm just racking my brain with ideas, and I can't come up with shit. Uh, yeah, that ain't a solution. I think setting yourself on fire is a bit dramatic. Oh my god, I said it in the wrong voice. I think setting yourself on fire is a bit dramatic. See, I didn't even read that part. <laughs> He's literally talking, trying to talk with her about how to fucking commit suicide. You jackass. How can you claim to be sensitive to mental health issues when you're sitting here just trying to get me to feel sorry for you? It's the only solution. I have been, th I have been thinking about it for a year and <laughs> it's the only way out. She was, uh, she was right. No, she wasn't. And you're not either. Get, so get the fuck out of my DMs. <laughs> Please don't feel sorry for me. Is that what you really think this is? Yes, I do. You must really think I am a monster. Oh, God. God just keeps going with this bullshit. You must really think I'm a monster. A monster. <laughs> Uh, yes, I do, yes. However, like I said, you need to be better than what people think you are. Like, she says, she's saying you're a monster, but, like, she's also giving you some leeway, dude. Like, she's trying to sympathize with you, despite her personal feelings. Like, you could at least be appreciative of that. Oh, uh, with Division Productions, you have to look back at your chat after this video and see all the different films with Moot in the title. <laughs> the Lion Moot. Oh, God. Hoot, hoot or moot? Oh, okay, okay. I, I'm gonna go back and look at it. I'm not. I'm if if I get distracted with this shit, I'm never gonna get this done. Like, there's so many pages I have left of this shit. Oh god. Well. Uh. Well, that isn't even part of this. I was just hoping to make you happy by telling you this. I was just hoping to make you happy by telling you I was gonna kill myself. Cause that's totally gonna make people fucking happy. Like, oh yeah, I'm gonna fuck it off myself. Um, in July, I'm leaving all my money to St. Jude's Hospital. Because I'm a worthless, fat, I'm a worthless, sad, fat sack of crap. <laughs> yeah, that's supposed to be, make people happy. Get the fuck out of here. You're such a, like, a, a, just a fucking miserable piece of shit. Oh, God. Okay, hang on one second, guys. I just want to make you happy. I'm not trying to manipulate the situation and stop you from making videos on me or saying anything bad about me. No, no, that's not what it is. I just want to make you happy because suicide makes everybody happy. <laughs> oh, God. I never thought your sympathy was an option, and clearly it wasn't. Oh, God. In truth, though, I think the root of all of the problems I have with you stem from the fact that I think you just hate yourself. Yeah. I want to tell you to make you... Ha I wanted to tell you to make you happy ahead of time before the others get to be happy. I swear to fucking God, someone just punched his ass. Someone please rip his beard, rip his beard off, and then rub pour rubbing alcohol in it. Cause oh, ooh, just f this, this this whole conversation is just musty. It's just musty. Pour like just spray some Febreze on it. Cause uh, I don't feel fresh right now, <laughs> and I don't like seeing you parlay that self hatred onto your fans. Sorry if I, that. Sorry if that failed. Uh oh um. Sad face. Uh, someone committing suicide doesn't make them happy. What, what would make you think? What would make you think that's even remotely the case here? Why do you think my DMs are open? Why do you think I told people to come and talk to me when they need you, when they need to? <clears throat> no, <clears throat> not the suicide part, but the part about my fans not having to deal with me and about winning and stuff. Like, get the fuck out of here. You were lying, you were lying ass. So if you just wanted to make her happy, then why'd you mention the suicide shit? No, I just wanted to make you happy, I swear. It was, it was, it was, I was gonna make you happy about the good shit, not, not me, you know. Not, not me getting caught by a harpoon. 
Yeah, that, that, that was my plan to commit suicide. I was going to swim out to international waters and then get hit by a harpoon. And then I was going to die like, right there while pledging allegiance to Cheetos. Like, that's what I was going to do. <laughs> Why do you think I'm talking to you right now when I should have been asleep over an hour ago? Because I care. I know you wouldn't want most people to die, but I never imagined that would extend to Mr. <laughs> me. <laughs> if I didn't care, I wouldn't have even bothered with you in the first place. Like 99% of everyone else on the planet Earth. I'm talking to you now because I believe in you. I, can, I believe you can be better. Oh God, everyone's saying moot in the goddamn chat. <laughs> oh shit. Inside Moots, Moot Pool, J Long Moot. Oh, uh, 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 f oh my god, Atomic, no, Atomic, whatever. J Long Moon, I'm starting to understand why he, his wife left him. Yep. Because who would want to be with a self pitying, uh, manipulative jackass? Nobody. Well, get some sleep. Sorry for keeping you awake. I promise you, I promise you will. I promise you we will make a lot a lot of people happy really soon and you will get to win and the rest of Reddit too. Oh my god. Because I believe that all people can be better, but your con uh. but your continual actions to the contrary have really aggravated me, not because I hate you. I am already better than the person you imagine me to be, but you will never believe that anyways. Oh, the s smallest violin, you jackass. Just play the smallest violin. Oh, J. Mootbone, new boogie drama. It's kind of new. It was new, like, I think like a week ago. I don't know. I just wanted to talk about this. Or maybe it was a few days ago that I, because I booked, I first saw him these uh, DMs like a few days ago. So, but who knows? It might be a week. It might be, oh, shit. I missed, I missed the super chat. Oh, wait, what the fuck? <laughs> Alright, hang on a second. Damn it. I missed the super chat. Okay, uh, Snicker News 499 super chat. Uh, oh, wait, no, no, no. That's something else. The fuck? Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, wait, wait there it is. The fact that you still do that voice even when you're not reading the text. It's priceless. It's a real method acting right there. Uh, Wiz Division, uh, five dollars super chat. Thank you. Oh my god, I don't know. Yeah, I think that was just old super chats. Okay, forget it. Mm. Uh, oh, not because I want to see you fail. Not because I want to see you dead. You and I are on the same platforms, and we both have the same responsibilities to our audiences and fans, even if you don't see it that way. Well, what you want is moot anyway. <laughs> he said it again. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, oh, uh, Draven Steinbecker, $2 Super Chat. This is for the Lincoln Park cover. <laughs> Love you. Yeah, thank you. Um, I don't have the best voice. I sound like a fucking cat being strangled, but, you know, I try my best. But, yeah, he said fucking moot again. Again. It's his favorite word. Oh, uh, like I said, it's already over. And he said, it's over. <laughs> so moot is already over. I'm trying to find another way and have been and have been for a long time. There just isn't one. Sorry. Uh, I'm not speaking to you in the same name of YouTube drama. In this, I'm not speaking to you in the name of YouTube drama or whatever. I really genuinely don't give two shits about that. Oh, Massive Legend $2 Super Chat will donate a dollar for every moot, he says. <laughs> oh, God. Might be a while because I still got a lot of pages to read. I know you are going to believe this is all manipulation, but I want to tell, <laughs> but I want to tell you one more time, one more thing anyways. Listen to one last thing since I listened to your story. Of course. I really am not the, I really am not the person they make me out to be on Reddit. I tried so hard to show you guys, but it was too late. I screwed up a lot in the last year because I went batshit insane. Worst two years of my life. Now that I almost, now that I'm almost saying again, it's too late anyways, but yeah, you're saying like, yeah, you're going on people's fucking DMs. You're manipulating, manipulating them, suicide baiting them. But you, yeah, I'm totally saying now, 
I'm totally sane, guys. I'm taking my pills. Oh. His pills are his teeth, by the way. <laughs> his medication. He just he just went to the dentist and like, okay, take my medication. Because I don't want to keep swallowing the pills. I'll just they'll just I'll just use them as my teeth and they'll slowly dissolve into my <laughs> And they'll just slowly dissolve and get into my system that way. That way I don't have to swallow them. I mean, like, look at look at those big ass look at his big ass fucking teeth. They gotta be his medication. Big ass horse teeth. Uh I do care about my fans. I do care about you. I do just want to make people happy. I know you will believe that. It's okay. When I'm gone, you will know it was true because you will know it was true because the proof will be in the acts. Giving everything away and wait until my fans forget about me to off myself. They will just say it's a form of manipulation though. That's okay. Maybe you will believe me since we talked tonight. Maybe not. I hope so. I say I love you because I do. What the fuck? <laughs> fans, fans and haters alike. I really have no ill will. I'm oh, sorry, no ill will. I really have no ill will in my soul for you or anyone. Can I ask you something then? If you care, if you care about me, I wish you nothing but the best. I love you, my friend. Thanks for trying to help. I see you, your good intentions, and I truly appreciate them. Ask. If you're really determined to go through with this plan, can you at least do this? Keep a bit of money for yourself and use it to go to therapy? Got a charity in mind or something? No. I'm already in therapy, dude. It can't help. No, that not just mental therapy. Nothing can. <laughs> Get yourself committed somewhere away from social media. Yes. <laughs> Ting! Um, shit. My eyes are still watering. I hate it. Ugh. I have already done that twice in the last year. It didn't help. You said you were going to delete your Twitter. Why are, why are you still on Twitter? You said you have the strength of a titan. <laughs> you, so why do you cower in the fear of Reddit? Cower in the fear of Reddit. Because how they celebrated when I said that. I will be off it soon enough, though. They can celebrate then. Fine, if you don't see therapy as an option, then how about this instead? Because this is too much even for a... <laughs> because this is too much even f <laughs> for even a titan to hold. <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, Twitter is too... Twitter is too much even for a titan. <laughs> oh, this Reddit shit. This Reddit shit, homie. It's just too much. You know I'm a thug. Thugs don't, can't take Twitter. <laughs> oh, help. <laughs> help me! Oh, fuck. Um, because it's too much even for a Titan. But I, was, but I was wrong. I am no Titan. Yeah, no shit. I am horribly weak, and you can clearly, you clearly see that. No, sorry. See this. <laughs> the Moot Titan. <laughs> Uh, because this is too much for you to, oh yeah, I already read that. Before you go through with your plan, delete your Twitter for good, tell people it is for your, for your mental health, and just do it. No money required, just a bit of self-control. Deleting Twitter won't make the damn stop. <laughs> Nothing will. <laughs> it doesn't matter. People are going to say what they're going to say. But it's none of your business. Exactly. So I won't be deleting Twitter since it doesn't matter. Oh my god. He can say, it doesn't matter. Moot. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Moot. Um, It'll all be over. Like the same shit over and over again. Like being able to respond to their hatred and explain my side of things to my fans here. So I will do it till I am gone. Even though it's killing you. It is my business because it hurts me and my fans and my employees and my actual career. Car Sorry, Kareet. Kareet! <laughs> this bitch empty. Kareet! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Twitter isn't killing me. Kiwi Farms is. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Kareet! 
Kiwi Farms is literally a place where everyone comes to laugh and make fun of people. Why on earth would their opinion matter? Reddit, Reddit is nothing compared to Kiwi Farms. Reddit is a good way to gouge how successful Kiwi Farms is by, by, but, ah, by Reddit is the, isn't the problem. Um, that's like valuing the critical skills of a porn hub commentator. <laughs> okay, that, that, yeah, that's pretty good. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. Ask Chloe, ask Chloe why it matters. He keeps mentioning this bitch. So now he's using someone's, someone else's suicide or whatever. I don't know who the hell he's talking about. But he's using someone else. I'm assuming this person committed suicide. This Chloe person. And he's using that as... Like, you're not gonna feel sorry for him. So let me throw in some random <clears throat> chick who committed suicide. Maybe then. You'll be compelled not to do a video. Oh, Taylor Ramirez, $2 Super Chat. Moot Titan of Kareet. <laughs> <laughs> oh god this is gonna be a thing this is gonna be a it's probably gonna be a thing every time i'm on stream now probably oh god moot like this is gonna be like just pages upon pages of moot comments it's gonna it's it's gonna be hilarious i'm not even fucking i'm not even being um i'm not even being uh uh sarcastic I'm all, I'm fucking, I'm not, I can't really see the comments right now, but I'm all, <coughs> but I know they're going to be funny. Oh God. They are military. Oh my, really? Do you really think, oh, well, I didn't read this part. Do you really think dying will stop people from talking? They are, they are militarized and their astroturfing is impacting every aspect of my life. <laughs> what? Boogie, get the fuck off, off Twitter. Like, honestly, get, get a life. You think it'll shut... Oh, shit. You think it'll shut up anyone? Remember Amanda Todd? No, but they will have to talk about how I left all my money to charity when they do, when they do talk. Smiley face. Oh, my God. Uh, Katie Wilson says, what have we done? <laughs> Wizard Mission Production says, what if I started in your chat and it could never be undone? <laughs> Oh god, J exceeds uh, Geo. J Longbone gets Moot. Uh, Moot the Titan of of Korea. <laughs> it's like a great fantasy novel. Oh shit. Okay, Queen CC. I'm I'm sorry, but the Mootigans contagious. <laughs> uh, let it be known that I was gr that I was ground Moot. Oh god. God damn it. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh shit! Oh wait. Um, the lone cartoon three ninety nine super chat. This moot empty Kareem. <laughs> Remember, I'm the one who came up with that first. The patent pending. <laughs> oh god. Um. Oh, if you really cared about your fans and viewers, you you cling to every last shred of your of life you have left in you. Even if you have nothing left, even if, you oh shit, even if you have nothing left to live for your, <clears throat> to live for in yourself, you can live for them. And because you live for them, nothing anyone says can hurt you. I will. Already told you I will. Wait till the, I will. I, I will. Already told you I will. Wait till they, the forget about me. I promise. Nobody's going to forget about you because you're leaving them with an unforgettable legacy. Mm, is he? <laughs> and let me tell you, it ain't a good legacy. Oh, well. <laughs> there you go! <laughs> oh, I was about to say. Um, the internet rallies around hilarious stories of failure and makes sure no one, nobody ever forgets them. No, but eventually the internet will forget that I exist in reality and then I can die without it going viral and then... And then that is when people, and that, and then that is when I will. People will talk about it after I swim online for a year or so. But generally, the internet loses interest when someone minds their own business. That's not true. You ain't wrong, I guess, but it's already too late, anyways. You know John Tron's story, right? His whole his whole controversy. 
I plan to make my name legally changed. So even if they run an obituary, no one will know it was me. Yeah, trust me, they'll know it was you. <laughs> they'll know it was you. There's no getting around this. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, they, they're not going to miss you. <laughs> I mean, well, not that, but like, they, they, uh, you're kind of hard to miss. That's, that's, that's what I wanted to say. Oh, God. Uh, they won't. Don't even plan to die in the same state. All you'll be doing, all you, uh, all you'll be doing. Oh shit! Uh, ooh, Taylor Ramirez, another five dollars super chat. If you're going to be on the EFAP special, then I'm super chatting mood. Oh god! <laughs> this shit is gonna. I just realized this shit's probably gonna follow me on in August when I go back on EFAP. Um, why do you look like Frankenstein's wife but black? <laughs> See, I. I be, yeah, shut up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, my hair just, it kind of just looks like this. See, it's dark. So you can't really see how pink it is, my hair is, because, you know, what, you know whatever. Oh, wait, I think I'm skipping right past that. <coughs> All you'll be, all you'll, oh, she said being doing, oh, she had a little typo herself. Oh. All you'll be doing by killing yourself, all you'll be doing by killing yourself is hurting people. Aren't you supposed to be the Mr. Rogers of YouTube or whatever? <laughs> Gonna wait till right after Trump wins his second term too, so I'll be one of the thousands that, what the fuck? <laughs> That's such a random thing to say. <laughs> I'm gonna wait till Trump wins after Trump wins his second term. It's such a weird thing to say. To mention at a time like this. Oh god, massive legend. Hands up, don't moot. The secret light of life of moot. Oh dear God. I'm gonna wait till right after Trump wins his second term. Lil no. Uh so I'll be the one that's that. Lol no. Lol no. I was never that, Raffle. That may not happen though. <laughs> It will go guaranteed. <laughs> I guarantee. Now off myself in July. Uh, well, I can't really say anything about that. I'm Canadian. Uh, crooked face. Lol. Those same fan. Yeah, whatever. I don't know what the fuck that meant. But okay, let's just say that it does happen. Can be hurt because I be saying because I, I kill myself or hurt because Reddit convinced them I I beat my I, I best my wife and fuck kids. <laughs> One seems obviously better to me. If I was a fan, if I was a fan, I know which I which I would want. God, it's getting so incoherent. Um, well, look, if you've got the evidence that what they're saying. What they are saying are genuine lies. Why not report the subreddit? Once they think I am a, a pedo wife beater, they won't be dead anyways. I have seen it. I mean, you've got options here. Not necessarily the right thing to do, but it's something you can do. But if you make that decision, you have to stand by it. My wife has legit tweeted that I never abused her and they ignored it. But I can't prove that I don't want to fuck kids because that is impossible to prove. Yeah, that also, the fucking kids thing. That's also something he keeps repeating over and over again. Uh, you have a reputation as being a severely spineless person. So show them that, that, that they're wrong by standing behind your actions. What do I, what, what do, I do? Go hang around a bunch of naked... Oh my god. What do I do? Go ha hang around a, a bunch of naked num kids? Uh, num kids? What? what <laughs> let me read that again. What do I do? Go go around hang <laughs> go hang around a bunch of a bunch of naked num kids and not have sex with them or something? <laughs> Raffle. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're coming off weird, uh, Boogie. You're coming off weird. That's all I'm saying. It ain't like that. It will on my birthday, dude. 
That's the last point. That's the entire point of this. How about you just start now? Show them I can be brave and do the right thing for my fans. Yeah, but the right thing for your fans isn't killing yourself. Think of how many of your fans are suicidal too and how your actions could affect them. Do you want to be responsible for the deaths of your fans? Yes, it is. I'm sorry you can't see that, but the sooner I disappear, the less of them get convinced I am a kid fucker. With Division Productions, $5 Super Chat, that's how we're going to win. Not by mooting what we hate, but by mooting what we love. Oh, shit, you just had to fucking quote The Last Jedi. Oh, God. Yeah, thank you for the super chat with Division Productions. Oh, God. Um, I feel more of them will kill themselves over thinking I am, for Think Kong, I am a pedophile, pedophile. I feel more of them will kill themselves over Think Kong, I am a pedophile, a pedophile too. A pedophile, though, shit. But I see your point. <laughs> I can see that thing and uh, it's kind of cut off. Okay, uh, Mr. N, $2 Super Chat. So basically, he is a hillbilly Onision. Dear God. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. But yeah, he, he's, he's getting there though. Actually, oh, f fuck it. Hold on, I need some tissue. I'm dying over here. <laughs> Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Okay, okay. Oh, no, I won't. I am going to tweet lots and lots of pics. This, this is all entirely why I'm in here. No, I won't. I am going to tweet lots and lots of pics. This is entirely why I'm here. People do like seeing you out and about, clearly. Let them live vicariously through me one more month. Oh, God. Why not take the pics and post them later? Take some pics with fans at the park and give them some love. Okay, Twitter. Focus on having fun first and then share it with others. I can't hurt fun. It's too late. <laughs> it's too late. He said it's too late again. In the end, it doesn't even matter. <laughs> um... I haven't had fun since the divorce. I don't know. Oh, shit. I haven't had fun since the divorce. I don't know what fun even is. Ah, uh, I think I get it now. Interesting. I legit, I legit only have stayed alive in the last year for my fans, and now I see dying Chris. Now I see dying Chris is the best way to serve them. You getting it now? That's the depression and anxiety is real. That the that's the oppressive anxiety is real and makes me miserable twenty four hours a day. No, I already knew that. <laughs> Something else started to make sense. You begin to understand that the fans you think I am talk taking advantage of are the only reason I didn't off myself when she left because I couldn't do that to them. Because I couldn't do that to them. Nope, not really. I've been operating with the mindset that you hate yourself and that you parlay that hatred onto your fans. But now it seems like you're not parlaying the hatred. Rather, you're putting every last vestige, vestige, vestige of hope you have into them. Um, nope, not really. I have been operating with the mindset. Okay, wait. To the point where any critical rhetoric seems like a devastating blow. Okay. Nope, not hope, dude. You are wrong again. Okay, what would you say it is? 
I am their slave. I try to serve them 24 hours a day. It's all I think about. How I can entertain them, inspire them, help them. What topics they want me to cover. Ah, I see. And now the best way to serve them is to die in a few years after changing the message uh, one last time. Nope, still can't say that's the best way to serve them. <laughs> and you can just hear, you can just feel, um... You just feel her losing patience with this motherfucker. Um, I tried so hard to make Reddit happy, but in the end, it doesn't even matter. <laughs> Wait, um, the lone cartoon four ninety nine super chat. If he actually killed himself because of because of being accused of pedophilia, that will just convince people that it was true. So he dig himself even deeper. Like yeah. <coughs> oh my god uh, it's, oh shit it, yeah I already lost it damn it I was gonna read that fucking I was gonna read that uh, I think um Atomic Comics or something or a, 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 a comic yeah I'm all over the fucking place every time I get on st stream I get it fucking um Twitter paid it <laughs> mm. Oh, I tried so hard to make Reddit Reddit happy because they were once fans, but I couldn't do that and stay alive at the same time. And they are gonna make sure the fans I have I have left hate me because they believe I'm a pedo. So go on and let them think that. If you know it's not true, then what's the problem? This makes Reddit happy, and and maybe they will leave my fans alone. I know it's a fool's errand, but it's the only thing I have left to try. Loads of people think I'm a whore. I don't know. I didn't know her story. Like, it was just random because I don't know who she, this person is. Loads of people think I'm a whore despite the fact that I've never even had sex. If you know it's wrong, it shouldn't affect you. Because it hurts my fans really bad when they believe they supported a monster. I know it's not true, and I hope you uh, know now, too. <clears throat> Well, I can't say that for sure. Certainly, I feel as though I've gotten greater context. But my fans believe it, and it ruins them when I when they do. I am so sick of staying alive for selfish reasons, just to der fans yet hurt daily. However, I maintain maintain skepticism in all my interactions of of this nature. Truthfully, I have only seen one side of the arguments. However, like I said, I don't really care about your past. Only what I was perceiving, only what I was perceiving is what I was reacting to. <clears throat> sure, man, it's okay. You still think I'm a monster. Either I prove you wrong in a month and that's great, or I prove you right and that's great too. Either way, you are happy. Well, given this greater context, I think there's only one way you could prove me, prove to me that you're not the monster people think you are, and that's to stay alive, you fucking idiot. <laughs> How many pages I got left? Fuck! <laughs> oh, it's been so long! Um, and Reddit will be happy, even if you aren't, even if you aren't, and while it will hurt my fans that I am dead, it will hurt them far less than if they think I rape kids. Well, at least he didn't say fuck kids this time. Because I was getting really tired of that. Hmm. Well, like I said, you and I don't... You and I don't... Mister. My fans do. It's already over. I tried everything I could to change Reddit's mind, and I can't. It's, the, it's a done deasy. It's a done deal. <laughs> Gotta be up in two hours. Good night. Please keep your promise after... After I am gone, can you share this? But not till then, okay? <laughs> but not till then. Wink, wink. Cause now, now you got some asshole reading it on her stream, mocking the shit out of you. <laughs> um, this is not of Reddit's business. I told you that. Nothing you've said requires their attention. Not that it would anyway. I can tell you what I'm gonna do though. I mean, after I am gone, if this could get you some clout or something, feel free to do it. But thank you for waiting till I am gone. I am going to unsub from that subreddit and I'm going to leave you alone. However, I'd still like to be able to talk to you. 
please don't do anything other than what you were already going to do. Mix your video, trash me, make money doing it, please let me serve you. Oh my god, really? Oh, fuck off. <laughs> let me serve you, baby. Oh god. Uh, be our guest, be our guest. <laughs> Put our service through the dishes. <laughs> Oh, tie a belt around my neck, Sherry, and we could provide the rest. <laughs> I'll take the pills, drown myself. <laughs> uh, or drink the bleach I got on my shelf. <laughs> anyway, please don't do anything other than what you were... Okay. Actually, actually, that video wasn't going to be made to trash you. That video was pretty much just going to be like the conversation we had today. I was going to present some questions for you and hope that you would answer. Well, that's what they... Oh, Mr. Ann, $5 Super Chat. Girl, you need to watch the video called uh, Tentacoliono Pingo's Song. It's a weird, weird as hell and surely it will heal your wounds. I'll make you break your heart here. I don't like because I was gonna I'm just gonna limit this stream to this, and are you just are you just asking me to watch it or react to it? Because you want me to just watch it? Yeah, I'll watch it later. <laughs> but after this, I'm gonna be chilling because I need to get, start getting more sleep. Like honestly, I've been going to bed at like 5 a.m. every goddamn night. It needs to end. Ugh, waking up dry as hell. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, that's what they like to see. That's what they like to. See. That's what they what they like to see. So please trash me and get some subs and money from it. Let me help you, dude. <laughs> since your DMs were closed, since your DMs were closed, I also wasn't going to monetize it. If you want, I will even tweet about it so they can see us interacting. You can be the guy. You can be the guy who brought me down. God, like wah wah, just a bunch of wah wah wah. Um, and I don't give a toss about sub subscribers since YouTube has made them inconsequential at this point. Uh. Mate, seriously. I said this wasn't about some stupid YouTube drama. Well, that's a mistake YouTube... Well, that's a mistake YouTube suppresses videos that aren't monetized. So... Oh, shit. So please monetize it. Excuse me. I was in the same situation last year with Butch Hartman. My goal isn't to get clout or whatever. My goal is to get the truth. I know, I know you just want, I know you just want to help my fans. So let me help you. Oh shit, hiccups. Mr. N, $2 super chat. You could react if you want to, just the messenger. Okay. Well, I'm not doing it tonight. Oh, because I know this is already draining me. It's like it's starting to drain me. Drain me before. It wasn't before. But it's starting to fucking drain me. Just getting rid of my hiccups. Oh, Jesus. Oh, massive legend. Uh, translation, make a video so people can feel sorry for me. Yeah, basically sums that up. He, he wants the uh, the sympathy. Um, Wiz Division Productions, how do you think we feel? You're a hero, J-Lo, for sitting through this. Oh, thanks. But I, I'm no hero. I'm no hero. <laughs> Um, I not, ra I'd rather not, I'd rather you not use my, my, <laughs> I'd rather you not use any potential video I make as a scapegoat. Actually, I was never a fan of yours. Dude, please, dude, please listen though. I had only vaguely heard about you until last year. My only interest in you was what I perceived to be manipulative behavior. 
If you don't, if you don't, oh my god, he's misspelling the same few fucking words. Every time he types make, it makes misc. <laughs> if you don't misc that video, then you will have proven yourself right. I don't want to feel I manipulated you out of it. Please still make it. I am begging you. I don't want another reason to feel like shit. I have plenty. Yeah, that like, oh, he's, pro he's probably thinking right now, like, mission accomplished. <laughs> I know, I'm pro pretty sure she still made that video. I might go search for it myself just to see if it, it happened. Uh, I'm still go I'm still gonna make it. I didn't... I'm still gonna make it. I didn't say I wasn't going to. That was never my intention. Yeah, whatever, motherfucker. Whatever, nigga. No, I get it. But a lot of it will be... No, I get it. But a lot of it will be repeated information from what we talked about today. However, I would appreciate you not t talking shit about me behind my back. Okay, good. Go hard. Get ready what they want, please. You have been very kind tonight, and you deserve the subs and views, and I want you to get jam. <laughs> as I said, as I said, I'm going to leave you alone and keep this private, so I'd appreciate if you didn't just shit on me somewhere else. Repeated information. Just don't include anything I said tonight in it, and that's fine by me. Oh, this butterball is cunning. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yo, for repeating information, we'll just don't add anything from, like, from uh, what we said tonight. And uh, I'll be good. You ain't slick, nigga. Remember I'm, not, remember, I'm not your enemy just because I'm being critical of you. Dude, I don't even know you or anyone else who knows you, so I won't have a chance to talk to shit talk to you, no offense. I meant your fan. I meant to your fans, you know, brigading and all that. I may not be a big channel, but I'm not exactly hard to find. But please, shit talk me. Call me every name in the book. It can get you a ton of views and subs, and I want you to have them. I think you have a good heart, and you, someone who, and you, someone who does deserve those 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 cues, those cues. Not a big channel yet. Stop kissing her ass, dude. It's not working. She's gonna make it. Regardless. If you take a look at my content, you know that getting views is not really a concern of mine. I'm not really a trend chaser. <clears throat> but make a few videos about me and it'll help you get there. One is enough. <laughs> and after I am dead, use those logs, okay? Promise me you will. Promise me you will, but only after I die, okay? I'm not Turkey Tom or uh, the right opinion. I'm not in this for the tea. Oh, that's kind of unfair knock at Turkey Tom and the right opinion. Oh, but whatever. Let's move on. Uh, I know, right? Who? I well, <laughs> I read that completely wrong. I don't know who those people are. Do they make videos about me? Yeah. And Boogie, you know, you know who the fuck these people are. If you know who she is, you know who they are. Don't act stupid. Don't act stupid, bruh. I know you sarn in it for the tea, but listen though, please. I'm really, really not <laughs> in it for the tea. Like she could easily have said she wasn't listening, and I wouldn't blame her. I've been openly critical of. Uh, oh, I've been openly. I've been openly critical of things like cancel culture and YouTube drama in the past. Use me and my name with my permission to spill that tea this one time, then use that momentum to do good with it. Okay, let me serve you and your community in that way. Jeez, would you f stop fucking talking? Honestly. Uh, hmm. I gotta sleep, but promise me you will go hard on me. Oh, God. You sound like a fucking desperate bottom. <laughs> please go hard on me, Mommy. Please. Go hard on my, my bunghole. Please. I need it. <laughs> Get Reddit's attention and try to use that attention to turn me, turn them into better people. <clears throat> It's what I tried to do, but I failed hard. But if you can do it, then my death will mean something, man. So please try. Oh, Cosmo, uh, uh, Ber uh Bergenstein, Bergenstein, uh, spill that tea one last time. <laughs> it sounds like, it sounds like such a lame ass, it sounds like a lame ass line from like a really corny teen movie. Like, spill that tea one last time. <laughs> That's so bad. It's so bad. Well, I'm certainly not going to be playing devil's advocate. Call me a wife beater. 
Call me a wife best and kid rapist and worst. You won't be the first or the last, but you seem to be someone who deserves the clap for doing it. All right, so now he's going like full on. See, before it was like, it seems like, okay, he's still like trying to get, he's still trying to get sympathy. But it was like, okay, we'll just tell people what a piece of shit I am. But now he's going back to like the, oh, t tell people the lies that I, the, tell people the things I said were lies about me. Oh, Mr. N, $2 super chat. This sounds like Bunty King. <laughs> This is slightly no no bunty kings is still worse i'm sorry putting your nose up someone's ass <laughs> like you could piss on me just do it do it <laughs> yeah that's right that's worse i'm uh, yeah yeah mm, but i'm not going to be an, an unmitigated asshole either please be an unmitigated asshole it's what they love I know you don't watch my videos, but one thing I say a lot is, all I can tell you is how I feel. That's going to be the gist of the vid. I wish I could do that, then I wouldn't have to die, but I can't be that person. I can't live that kind of life. The kind of life where I shower fucking regularly and not man manipulate people online. I just can't do it, man. I can't do it. Anyways, I have my word that this will remain between us. A word she didn't keep for long. <laughs> well, please pretend to feel I am a wife-beating kid fucker. Oh, finally, he spelled, he spelled beating right. Finally. I would never encourage you to lie, but this is, but this one lie fan served the, but this one, but this one lie fan served the greater goods. So please consider it. Thank you for talking with me. I will do as I see fit for the video. Remain between us until I am dead. <laughs> Please promise you will use it after. Mm, I wish I could do that. I wish I could. I wish I could do that. Then I wouldn't have to. Wait, he just fucking repeat the same thing. Mm, okay, I, I think this is a repeated page. Oh, but in the meantime, I'll leave you to your own. Okay, but please consider going duper hard. <laughs> it'd be, it'd be, it really, it really trendy. It really trendy, and I deserve it after that joke about Etika. It's, okay, I guess he's not talking about when he mentioned Etika in this conversation. I will do as I see fit. Oh, also, I won't engage with that subreddit, like I said. Oh, good, but I hope you consider my advice and go fucking hard. I really don't mind, and it can really help you. Please do. Night's all. I know it hurts my asshole, but I don't mind, and I like it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. I already said I don't need help, but I appreciate the sentiment regardless. Good night. Please engage with them, use their lies, and repeat them for your video. It will go viral if you do. Call me a wife-beating kid fuckmer. <laughs> Call me a wife beating kid fuckmer. Fookmer. No, fuck. Fookmer. Fookmer. They will eat. They will est it up. Oh, Wizard Vision Productions, $5 super chat. No one adult man should be bringing up kids in questionable actions involving them this many times in one conversation. Like, he, it's like, she's trying to go to bed, and he keeps fucking engaging with this bitch. Uh, Mr. N, $2 Super Chat, Boogie plus Bunty plus Judy Hops equals Bogney Hops. Almost. Like, I'm sure... Uh, I think you can get a better anagram, or... Would that be an anagram? God, I'm so daft right now. But I think you can get, better, I think you can get a better anagram out of that. But I think you should add, uh, I think, um, uh, I think, uh, uh, Nick Wilde would be better, not Judy Hopps, because Nick is more of a groveling bitch, like, like Boogie and Bunty. <laughs> um, good night, Boogie. <laughs> Wait, let me read that all together. Um, please engage with them. Use their lies and repeat them for your video. It will go viral if you do. Call me a wife-beating kid, kid Fookmer. 
They'll east it up. Good night, Boogie. <laughs> night, man. Sorry if I seem extra crazy right now. I am really manic. I guess you can tell. Oh, really, bitch? Don't worry about it. Like, yeah, she's she's checking out completely. This is my biggest issue. My brain, man, is broken as fuck. I do this sort of thing a lot. Newt died. Love you. <laughs> Newt died. Love you. Uh, oh, shit. You talk to crazy people? You talk to crazy people? Cool. Good night. <laughs> you in mental health? No, not officially, but I have vested interest in psychology, particularly the psychology employed in mob mentality and, and cults. That's awesome, man. Noble work. I never was able to finish my degree, sad face. One of my biggest regrets. That's unfortunate. <laughs> it's like she's trying to fucking blow you off, man. Go to bed. Nah, dude. Siri for wasting your time. <laughs> I hope when the time comes, it will make you happy, even if it didn't tonight. Night, man. Like, dude, like, shut the fuck up and go to bed. Go to bed. You're worse than me trying to end a goddamn stream. Shit. <laughs> oh. You didn't waste my time. But yes, good night. <laughs> oh, since I trust you. Oh, my God. Stop. Fucking stop. Look at this shit. Go to bed! <laughs> oh, God. Oh, since I trust you, I made 5K off 4 million views last month. Ooh. Some, view, some videos do better than others. The, the video I shared was a Francis video. It only made 400 off uh, 600K. I don't know how you confuse that one, that one chart enough to compare it to my entire monthly income, but if you wanted to know my monthly income, there you go. 5K off 4 million. I am really blessed to make 5k a month, still from AtRev, but it still sucks that Oki, that Oki video made me so little on so many views. Hey man, hope you are well, feeling better. Hey man, hope you are well, feeling better today. Stayed off Twitter too. Oh, this must be the next day. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, it's the same day, but it's later on that day. Oh yeah, okay, so this, this tweet is later on that day. This DM is later on that day. Hey, good to hear. <laughs> she's, so, she's fucking done with this dude. Uh, <clears throat> last night was me at my most dis dissociated and manic. Sorry you had to see it. Hope you are well and have a good day. It's really okay. Don't worry about it. My day has been fine. As I said, I do this a lot. Awesome. Do anything cool? Oh my god. Now he's trying to be chatty. Get the fuck, <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Awesome. Do anything cool? There's no need to apologize. No, not really. Just at work. And she's at work. That's that's embarrassing. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, Mr. N. $2 super chat. Nick plus Bunty plus Boogie. Wild King Boogie. I try. <laughs> uh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Oh, Strood, uh, Daddy says, honestly, just leave him on read at this point. Yeah, he's a fucking pest. Shit! Uh, no need to apologize. Uh, what do you do for a day job and do you love it? Oh my god, fuck off! I work in the animation industry and I'm very happy to be here. Not every day is a carnival, but I enjoy my free my time here in general. But anyway, I'm glad you were able to stay off Twitter for a bit. Were you able to have some fun where you went? Yeah, I did for a change. A couple of rides were fun. Met a lot of fans, though. And I love meeting and hanging out with them. Hey, that's good to hear. I'm gonna go walk so much. I passed out once, and I can barely stand up now. Love pushing myself to the end. I see. <clears throat> well, just make sure you get enough hydration, you fat fuck. <laughs> She's just whispering bullshit, like whispering insults under her breath as she types it. Ha ha ha! That ha ha! That was that was it. Was hyd dehydrated. I gave three different fans a hundred bucks today, uh, two via PayPal. Shit. Oh, this nigga. Do you carry? Do you carry a water bottle with you when you go out? 
picking random people on the thread to help out feels great. It's uh, much appreciated. You have no idea. Nope. No problem. Just said it. I know you. I know times are tough, and I'm picking fans on that thread to help. You want to chat some time? I'm here. I'm crying right now. You have no idea. Definitely okay. Definitely always have my support. Blah blah blah. Uh, what are you normally? What are you no? Oh. Uh, Taylor Ramirez, two dollars super chat. The second hand cringe is strong. Oh, massive legend said. Sounds like he's trying to smash before killing himself. <laughs> huh. I wouldn't be surprised from other stuff I heard about him. Um, what are you normally but forgot today? What are you yeah, normally but forgot today? Raffle. I see. I see. Like she's trying to blow you off, dude. Stop it. Stop it. We driving to DC now. Neat. Have a nice drive, you fuck. <laughs> Hang on, is this just more shit? But it's got it's a different resolution. Oh, uh, this is more shit. I don't know when this is though. But he's talking about cutting himself and all this other bullshit. Oh, god damn. I don't know when this was, but I'm just going to read it. Um, They won't. Let this show you what I'm up against. This, I'm not even going to say it in the voice anymore because my voice is getting tired. This won't even make a blip on their radar. And if it does, it will somehow be a bad thing. <gasps> oh, well, excuse me. <laughs> I ended up hurting myself really bad tonight. Been cutting on my legs lately. Which is new for me. I used to do my arms back when I used to do it. Regular. regular. But afraid my fans will see it. They are scared enough. But since the legs is new territory. I ended up gouging myself pretty good. Fuck my life. <laughs> Whee! Oh god. I wish I was able to eat. Or wish I did drugs or something. That was less destructive. I'm sorry you guys can't. Hold on. Maybe I can zoom in. That's better. You guys should be able to see that shit. Okay. Uh, we. I wish I was able to eat or whatever. Uh, not that I didn't eat like shit today, Raffle. Yeah, I'm just cutting myself today. But here's a joke about me being a fat fuck, Raffle. <laughs> Jesus. So what do you want me to do with this information? Do you want me to get you help? Sigh. I really didn't think you'd share our our conversation. Our conversation soon if i thought that i would have if i thought that i would have asked you not to i'm glad you made videos about me and i hope it's really profitable and good for you but i think it's really fucked up that you shared our private conversation oh this must be like this must be an addition this must be an addition to what was already posted because i didn't see this shit before or maybe i just maybe i missed or maybe i just skipped right past it i don't know because he must, be, he must be talking about the previous conversation before. Um, Mr. N, $2 super chat. Oh, man, now he... Demi Lovato, too. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, God. Yeah, and I asked you to get off Twitter. I thought it was private. I never gave you permission to share our private conversation, and I'm really disappointed in that. I said things I trusted you with. If you had listened to anything I had said, I would have been more inclined to keep it private. However, I said that... I would do as I saw fit with the, for the video. It doesn't matter. You're welcome to do what you want. I just wanted to let you know how fucked up it is to share private conversations. Very sad. Oh, well. Um, Taylor Ramirez, he typed out sigh. My God. <laughs> Boogs is like, I hurt myself today. See, I still feel. I hurt myself today to see if I still feel. Ugh. I focus on the ad revenue. <laughs> the only thing that's real. Um, and considering you took 0% of what I said to heart, I felt no obligation to continue upholding that. Yep, I know. Considering you also shared a private DM with me. 
not upset about anything else other than the fact that you shared a private conversation. That's really, really shameful. Ooh. From the guy, from the guy that gave you, gave a hundred to, from that guy you gave a hundred to, a hundred dollars to. I understand you have zero respect for me, but it's not cool with others. Practice what you preach. Pa- practice what you preach, mate. I asked that guy's permission to share it, actually. Now you've got to deal with the fallout. I hope you take this as a lesson. Yes, don't trust people with DMs. Don't talk to haters. I get it. Lesson learned. Oh, he's still doing this bullshit. You can share whatever you like from this conversation. Have a good one, and I hope... <laughs> And I hope your video did well. <laughs> Was that as like a slick uh, jab at her? Like, I hope you did well, ho. <laughs> ha. All right. If that's the lesson you've learned from this. It is, unfortunately. Love ya. <laughs> I don't think you do. I think that's sarcasm. <laughs> you don't love me. You don't love me. You just like my chompers. <laughs> <laughs> my pretty chompers that's all any woman loves me for when I chomp on their beef folds they love it <laughs> nope uh, and I know you don't love me either so I'm returning, just returning the favor I do, I genuinely do hate that you don't see that I'm so sorry you can't understand that sad face maybe listen to me next time I won't ever talk to you again, unfortunately, so I can't listen. Fair enough. Obviously, I can't trust you with a private conversation, so there's no reason to have one. Clearly. Although you could have if you just held... or Although you could have if you just held up your end of the bargain and listened to me. But I forgive you. I do love you. I do genuinely hope your video does well. I wish you nothing but the best. Like it all. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry you can't can't feel or understand that. Oh, God. Uh, fuck off. But it makes no less... But it makes it no less true. I wish you nothing but the best of luck in all you do. Farewell and good luck. No sarcasm at all. Alright, so that is fucking it, finally. It's over. It's over. Like, yeah, so, um... Yeah, Biggie to Biggie, <laughs> Boogie, Boogie two nine eight eight is a, a fucking like he's basically a stalker ex girlfriend who won't leave your fucking DMs. He's he, he's not that great of a person. He's not. I I do feel sorry for him on on, on some level. I just hope he gets his shit together because oh my god, it's just this is just stop. Just fucking stop. Just get, just, just fucking get off the internet. Like, do what she said. Get off the internet. Oh, Taylor Ramirez, another five dollars super chat mofo. You're talking to random, a random person. Oh shit. Oh wait, who's the vision? Ten dollars super chat. Some of my personal favorites. Uh, E, <laughs> uh, E-Cat, I'm a Poulsen, Another thing. Well, the last one. Kareet. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you, Wizard of Vincent Productions. Oh, my God. Like, shit is so fucked up right now. Oh, I'm trying to stretch this out. Okay, there we go. Mofo, you're talking to a random person. Of course, you should expect them to keep a private convo private. <laughs> but, yeah, that's that's book. Oh, shit. Massive Legend, $5 super chat. No moots in there, but here you go. Sorry for starting the moot wave, uh, mommy. Uh, lol. Almost moot. Also, moot is apparently a term they use in court or some shit. Now the moot thing is fine. It's just like <laughs> it was so random, and I didn't know where I never. I didn't see that shit coming. Oh, Jay Long wants. Uh, uh, Strudel Daddy says, Jay Long Moan, are you gonna read the moot comments? Um, on the next stream, I might. I don't know. I gotta look through a, a lot of fucking comments. <laughs> But yeah, I think I, I'm, I think I might pick out my favorite ones, and just like maybe show them at the end of the stream the next time I stream, on my, on the cringe stream, the, on cringe stream number sixteen, I might do that. I'm not promising anything because I got a lot of fucking videos to make. 
you know, a lot of shit to do, and there's a lot of fucking comments of y'all just throwing mood out there. But anyway, yeah, that that's yeah, that's boogie. That's boogie. <laughs> that's boogie. Yeah, he's um, like I said, yeah, he's mentally unstable. Like I said, I feel sorry for him to some degree, but. Oh, kill switch engage! I completely missed it. Well, you'll be able to go back and watch it. I'm not, I'm not like uh, I don't, I'm not like other streamers where I like delete the stream right after I'm done, like uh, like Mr. Medicare. Not that I'm like throwing any shade at him. I'm just saying I'm not gonna delete it after I'm done. Like it's still gonna be there, and it's gonna be in the stream uh, playlist on my fr the front page of my channel anyway. So you'll still be able to see it. Like you just didn't catch it live, unfortunately, but it's okay. I mean, I can't keep up with a lot of streams my, of my faves either, so. This is not, like, don't feel alone in that at all. But anyway. Book is just fucking, what the fuck? <laughs> this is why I take my time subscribing to certain people on YouTube. Because, Mr. N, $2 Super Chat, why don't we uh, call this uh, Mook working Burger King? He, he look. Did you intentionally uh, uh, type it that way? The fuck? Oh, uh, I guess she's saying he looks like the Burger King. I get like if he was depressed and out of a job, maybe. <laughs> but yeah, this is Mr. M Mudiker. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> if you're ever on his his stream one day, don't fucking tweet that. Don't fucking. Don't fucking type that out to him. Uh, Queen CC two dollars super chat. Bless you. Uh, bless you and night black uh, black bride of Frankenstein. Thank you. <laughs> and yeah, it, it, see, it, I had no choice but like put like these streaks in here and shit because I was running out of hair pretty quickly. So that's why I look like bride of Frankenstein. But whatever. But yeah, Boogie, yeah. Until he gets his shit together, he just sucks. He just sucks. But like I said, this is why I take my time following certain people on YouTube. I usually have a good uh, bullshit meter. I usually have a good bullshit meter. Like, I take my, I just take my time with following certain people. It's like, I don't think I'm into this person's content. They don't seem like they're all there or whatever. And usually my instincts are fucking right. There's a lot of people that's been outed for bullshit. That I wanted to su subscribe to, and I and I I held myself back for whatever reason. Like I'm Alex, I was gonna subscribe to him, but I didn't because I was like, eh, I don't know about this nigga. Because I would see, like, yeah, I would see, um, I would see him around, and like, you know, see, you see people say certain things, and you're just like, okay, I don't know, I don't know. But then there are other people I just don't subscribe to quickly because I just don't subscribe to people that quickly. Because I want to, like, feel them out first before I make a commitment. Even though, like, you're just subscribing to people. You're not paying for their, paying to subscribe to their fucking channel. But I still take my time anyway. Because, like, it, sometimes it'll be, it can be, um, suffocating to, like, to have a lot of people in your, in your subscription feed. You're like, oh, I gotta watch that and that. And I got this and this. And plus the, the, uh, the, uh, the fuck. Uh, the, uh, suggestions... The suggestions tab is all already filled with fucking people that I wanted to follow anyway. That I wanted to, wanted to subscribe to anyway. So it doesn't fucking matter. But anyway, yeah, that's going to be it for the night. After this, I'm going to get started on this little video I'm working on. And then my Unicorn Store video. Uh, full stop. Like, no no shortcut. I mean, no... Uh, no, um... No distractions with that. But yeah, like I, I got a little video coming out on that, that extra credits video. The one someone suggested, someone suggested, someone suggested it to me. I don't know who. I forgot who. But that extra credits vi credits video where he's talking about oh um stop normalizing Nazis because oh they randomly put me in a video game with a Nazi. That means I'm gonna become a Nazi. This is just, I should have to look at Nazis. Yeah, that one. I'm almost done with the video on that. After I'm done with that little edit, I'm going to, um, yeah, I'm going to start on my Unicorn Store review. So, there's that. 
Uh, okay, yeah, good night, everybody, and thanks for all the moot comments. That was a funny ride. I'm gonna look back on him and I'm gonna look back on him and read him when I get the chance. Oh, uh, Mr. N, two dollar super chat. Every uh, tentacle enjoy tentacle Leono. Wiz Division, two two dollar super chat. Night J, moot you. I I moot you too, Wiz Division. Thank you. Yeah, I love you. Like, I love you guys, and thank you for the super chats, all you guys in the moot. Thanks for enduring this with me. Oh my god, I need, I need a shower after that musty shit. That's that was too much must. But yeah, anyway, good night. See you later.